the smaller outlet accumulator must be dismounted before the pressure test is carried out. If there is room, the larger inlet accumulator can be tested while mounted. Note, it is not necessary to stop the engine and pump station to check the inlet accumulator if the accumulator is equipped with a cut-off valve and a mini-mess drain connection. See Instruction Book, Volume 2, Procedure 903. Close the supply valve and then open the equalizing valve by turning both handles to a horizontal position. Loosen the oil accumulators and unscrew them slowly to release any remaining oil pressure. Connect the hose to the reducing valve and to the filling valve. Insert a copper gasket and mount the 0 to 60 bar pressure gauge. Connect the reducing valve to the nitrogen cylinder and tighten all connections. Secure the inlet accumulator in a bench vise with soft jaws and remove the plastic plug. Carefully clean the sealing surfaces of the accumulator and the filling valve and mount the filling valve. Make sure that both the venting valve and the outlet valve are closed and then open the plug screw in the accumulator with a half inch square socket wrench. Read the nitrogen pressure and compare it to the value stated in procedure 903. If the pressure is too high, reduce the pressure by opening the venting valve. If the pressure is too low, make sure that the reducing valve spindle is turned fully counterclockwise and then open the valve on the nitrogen cylinder. Turn the spindle slowly in the clockwise direction until the outlet pressure is slightly above the specified pressure. Open the outlet valve, fill the accumulator to the specified pressure and then close the outlet valve. Adjust the torque spanner to the value stated in procedure 903 and tighten the plug screw. Open the venting valve. Close the valve on the nitrogen cylinder. Then open the outlet valve and turn the spindle fully counterclockwise. Remove the filling valve and once again tighten the plug screw to the specified torque. Finally mount the plastic plug. Secure the outlet accumulator in a soft jawed vise and remove the plastic plug. Carefully clean the sealing surfaces of the accumulator and the filling valve and mount the filling valve. Remove the 0 to 60 bar pressure gauge. Fit a copper gasket and mount the 0 to 10 bar pressure gauge. 
Repeat the pressure testing procedure. Refer to procedure 903 for the specified nitrogen pressure. Check the condition of the gaskets before mounting the accumulators. Mount the accumulators. Finally, close the equalizing valve and then open the supply valve by returning both handles to the vertical position.